Right then, today is the 25th of April, Sunday morning, and today we're in Manchester City Centre, uh, just near a place called Henry Street, which is also near lock number 82. Uh, today we're here courtesy of uh, Magnet and Steel RJ, they've picked this place today, uh, 8 o'clock in the morning, let's get on with it, right then. Right oh, so we're going to start off. Car's going past already. Right, we're going to start off with the beast. You know the one. My favourite. 500 double sided clamp magnet. And uh, we're going to start off with this. Bit dirty from last week at that uh, that canal we was at. That swamp. God, it was minging. But anyway, just give it a little swilling water then. So anyway, right. We'll start off with a 500. See what happens. And then we'll uh, we'll move on to the, uh, the drag queen later on. Right then, first three live chucks, let's go. Oh, we've got a bit of bubble action already. Well, this is looking promising. Nice little catch box, first chuck. Bonus ball money, it says on it. How good's that? Got ourselves uh, a little windscreen wiper as well. First spoon of the day. A little bit of wiring, bit of cage wiring, I don't know what that's all about. And uh, also, bottle top, some kind of uh, little ball bearing of some kind. It's not a musket ball, but it's just a, a big bearing back look at it. And also, four pence as well. So uh, I'm already in front of them lot. Nobody here yet. They're all too slow, aren't they? They don't like getting out of bed early. It's not bad for the first chuck, is it? Oh, there's something nice and big down there. The beast just moved it slightly. So maybe the uh, drag queen might have to come out a bit early. Chuck number two, spoon number two, I don't know. Take it easy bud, thanks for stopping. Chap can, and again, got three pence, three one pence pieces, marvellous. So I just tried to go where I was, just where I just it latched onto something. It's only about two metres out, so it wasn't really much of a chuck. Uh, all I got then was a bottle top, that was all. Right, so that's your three live chucks. I'll switch it off now. 
As soon as I find out what this big thing is here, I'll switch it back on. Right then. I tell you what, don't know what this is, but it's heavy and it's coming in. Tell you what, the beast has got a good grip of this. Well, look at that! Massive grid cover! Just look at that! That's what the beast can drag out, no problem at all! That's an absolute belt, going in the back of my van that one! So. Going on about the back of my van, right, I'm going to start taking away all of my really heavy iron that I'm going to get out because I've had a big stockpile of it in my, uh, in my garage back at home and uh, this week I've been to this, uh, a scrap merchant called uh, Sterling Metals uh, based in Warrington and uh, cracking lads, all of them, I'll give them a little rise out, I'm going to put, I'll put the thing up there, Sterling Metals and the lads names all down here. All, all four of them, cracking lads, they really are. Showed me around the place. They, they were brilliant. So, I actually made £106 in just scrap metal uh, that I've been storing in my garage. So, that's going to pay for a new magnet, a new GoPro. Who knows? Even my diesel getting back into to all these locations. So, from now on, anything like that grid cover could be straight home with me. Well, you need a few of them, you know. You get your, you get your money's worth for a day, don't you? Right then, let's get back in. So where we are on Henry Street, by the way, uh, it's actually free parking on a Sunday. Uh, you only have to pay Monday to Saturday. So if anybody else fancies to come down this area, down this stretch, feel free on a Sunday. You don't get charged. Just uh, seeing a little traffic guy then on the scooter. We just said to him, like, is it? Are we all right on here? He said. No problem at all, mate. No problem at all. So, anybody fancies coming? Henry Street, Manchester City Centre. We're right opposite a COVID testing centre uh, in the centre of uh, Manchester. So, uh, hopefully, we'll have a good day today anyway. Right then, let's get carrying on. Let's do this ranting, eh? Another little strange box there. I don't know what all that's about. Oh, it's all in, like, Spanish or something. I can't read Spanish, me. You know what I'm like. But anyway, have a little look at that, see if that'll uh, zoom in on there, what it says. Not sure if you can see that or not. Little blue box. Oh, look at that. Two, four, six pence. Marvellous. Well, I'm absolutely made up now, absolutely made up. We've come to this stretch and really the only people we told was the Northwest Magnet people. Also, now who's turned up, the legends, the legends, the Leeds Magneteers are here. How good's that? So, uh, let's just go and say a quick hello to them over here. And right here, just say hello. Look at this guy here. Look how, how handsome is this guy? Hey, I don't know. Could, could be a bit handsome. I just want to know how, how they found out that we're here today. I, I think they've got some spies on the go somewhere. I don't know. Got but anyway, got a tracker on your car. This is number one leader from Leeds Magneteer, William. And then, oh yeah, look at these two. Look, I'll give. I like these tops and everything you've all got. There he is, there's the man. There it's been is. a while, hasn't it, Craig, been since we last met you? It's been a while. Uh, was it the thing? It, but no, I think it was the uh, uh, North Ants, wasn't it? When we last Birmingham. met up, it was Birmingham, yeah, wasn't it? Yeah, it was. Up, yeah. yep. Here's Big Andy. He's here as well, sporting his nice. Look at that. There we go. Look at mag online magnets. Well, We'll put that online magnets. We'll get us all in like that and we'll bang it up there in the top corner for miles. Right then. Oh, also, 
Magnet and Steel RJ are here. Del, uh, Del, Del going to give you a little say hello in a minute. And Dan's just trying to find a parking space now as well. Because uh, there's quite a lot of double yellow lines around here. So, uh, oh, we've got some crackers out today. Oh, we're going to have some fun. Right then. Let's get on with it. I don't know if you can see that there on the floor, but all the way along here, it's all little uh, tying off points. So what I've done is, tied the piece back, as normal, you do not lose your magnets if you tie them back to something. Even if you just tie it round your waist, you know what I mean? Or round your foot, or round your wrist. But don't leave your rope lying round like some people do. And then you've got a job and half then, trying to get your magnet back, because the rope, half the rope that you buy nowadays, just sink straight to the bottom of the canal. I don't know. Right, so just want to uh, give a big shout out there to uh, Rebecca and uh, little Oliver. Uh, we're going down on the 15th uh, for a big meetup. Uh, we're going to have an amazing day, without a doubt, an amazing day. Uh, we're stopping over, so drinks, the full works. We're going to have a cracking time down there on the 15th. So, uh, big shout out there to Rebecca. Marvellous! So we've got a, a little black bag there with something in. Not sure what's going on there. Uh, it's been tied off a little bag. Uh, I'm scared of opening it up to be honest with you. Find out what's in it. It's a good chance around here it could be something like needles or something. I don't know. But, uh, so we've got a little black bag there. Might uh, open that up in a sec. See what's in there. Doesn't. Uh, oh, it's tent pegs. By the look of it. Yeah, little little tent pegs. There we go. As you can see there, little black bag full of tent pegs. Get get off me foot, will ya? Uh, on the other side of the magnet, we've got the uh, one of the old uh, cigarette rolling tins that you makes the old little homemade cigarettes. As you can see there, one of them ones that you pop in and it, you. Pop, cigarette pops out at the top there. Uh, I don't know if there's a design or anything on that there. I'll give I'll give it a little swell out later on, but it, it looks knackered, to be honest with you. Doesn't look as though that's going to be working again. Uh, looks like it's a little bit of a popular place around here because it's all like little seating areas. So obviously somebody's been just slung it in, haven't they? Had the air done as well. Can I? Got rid of that. That lockdown haircut that he had, it was like flaming wild man. But anyway, look at that now, eh? Don't I look beautiful now, eh? I've just had a little tiny lock, very, very small lock, that. Look at that. That's a little, little dinky thing there on the end. Smallest lock I've ever had, that, I think, by the look of it. So, uh, that's that, but guess who's turned up? Say hello to Mr. Daniel Slack. There we go, sir. How are you? All right. Yeah. <laughs> get, his, get, get his sign on like we don't flame and tell everybody enough who he is. DS Magnet Fishing. I give up, I do. Right, so uh, how many is here then? Now we've got quite a few, haven't we? We've got a couple. Seven of us now. Seven of us now, so. It's growing by the minute. Right then. Up there, got myself a nice little knife. Just a little prestige one there. It's only a little uh, kitchen knife, obviously. Little dinky thing like that. I think we've got like one of them little, uh, little, little like attack alarms when, when girls are getting attacked and they press the button. I think that's what that is, you know, there, that yellow thing. Uh, high and low. I think, I think that's what it is anyway. I could be wrong. Could be something completely different, but I think it's one of them uh, tap buttons where you, you press it and go. Wee, 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 wee. Okay. More coins. And a little, uh, a little clip of coming off a uh, oh battery charge off for a car. And a little thingy clip. Marvellous. Nice young ladies turned up now. Uh, who actually the, uh, made a mess of my rope and uh, hit from last week, as you know. As I showed you earlier on, you're okay. Yeah. Right, have you all right for a magnet though today, what? Yeah, I've managed to get to my parents. I've got my oh, have you been yeah. in? Did you get your laptop as well? Did you stop off? No, no, I've not Just... got a laptop. It was a, a Mac one. Was it? A, Mac, a Mac, yeah, not a Mac. Right, so <laughs> Sophie's here now, magnetic pull. 
So we've got Dan, Sophie, the boys, the Leeds lads, myself. Going to have a cracking day today. Right then. See you in a bit. See, see you in a bit. <laughs> What's all that about? Hey, Paul. Like us. Let's do a parachuting after this. So. <laughs> <laughs> we, we well, we're back, we're back. Get back, back. <laughs> a thousand and one, a thousand and two, a thousand and three, a thousand and four. Pull! <laughs> Magnetic pull, yeah. Magnetic pull, marvellous. Right then, let's get it. Let's get it all on. The beast keeps sliding across something all the time. It was doom heading. So I've just threw him here, grappling hook in now. And uh, Sophie's just giving me a little touch as well here. And I'll just show you now what we've got out. Sophie's giving me a touch. Got it. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, lean over it. Hold on, hold on. Lean over it. Stand it. Shut him. Do you want any thing on the side? That's the security panel. Got it. Okay, then I'll have a, have a little look at this. I think it's uh, an old, like, uh, you know, when you set up like a site, you can see the size of it there, because look at the size of the sofa compared to it. I know the sun's in the back there, so. But yeah, that's not bad, is it? I mean, Sophie just got that out. Marvellous! <laughs> Right, that's it now, I've had enough. The Leeds lot, William and Andy, they're throwing in these new flaming Evos. I'm not having it. The drag queen, she's coming out now. You know the drag queen, you know exactly who she is. It's time to go to battle. I'll give it three live chucks on this one as well now she'll only get jealous otherwise you know what she's like chuck number one an absolute boatload of rust She's got something solid there. Tell you what, she likes grabbing all that scaffolding tubing all the time, doesn't she? Six foot scaffold tube. Chuck number three. That was a weird feeling that was then. What's that? Ten pence, P. Oh, tell you what, she's not done far off you there. Right, I've got a right mixed bag here for my third chuck. So, uh, scaffold uh, bracket as normal. Bit of pink, uh, pink paint on that one. Must be the, the works colours. And then uh, some keys on that side. And also four pence piece as well. Lovely. I've got a clue what this thing is here, but it's uh, it's got Zen written on it in pen. Uh, it looks like that at the back end. And uh, I don't know, it's got a little thing there as well. Don't know what that's for. Anybody have an idea what that is? Please uh, let me know. Why is there a load of water on the bottom of my lens? What's going on there? Oh. Hold on, one sec. There you go. 
Right, have a little look now. See that water wasn't everywhere. Zen. Plastic thing. Not a clue. A little jab can. And a little bit of fencing. I think there's a boatload of that down there. That's a, I think that's what we're riding over all the time. The fencing. And it's coming off in little tiny bits. Hey, I tell you what, it's getting chock around here now. Clipping it. There's cars everywhere. There's, there's, there's loads of people walking by. Lovely. It's nice. So, James and Ryan have gone and done it again. Done it two weeks on the run now. They've had better finds than me and Dan put together, and we're getting a bit sick of it, me and Dan now. Aren't we, Dan? Yeah. We're having, we're not, we're not having it no more. We're just not going to let them come with us. But anyway, check out again this week's video by Ryan and uh, James. Magnet and Steel RJ. One big long word, can't miss it. But anyway, I've just got myself, I don't care. Look at that. Lovely. All the bits are gone on it though. Can't use this again. Hacksaw. Right, again, looks like we've got uh, another little knife there. Another kitchen knife. Again, stainless steel one. That's a little nice one as well. Oh, you're running. How's it still running? Another nice little rebar, back at van. Dan had one about 15 minutes ago, probably exactly the same. There you go, a rebar. Uh, I've got myself a part of a trowel, a little builder's trowel there. So you can tell by the shape of it and the way it is, the way it's designed. Another rebar. These rebars are coming out well now. That one. A little bit taller though, that one, than the other one. Small scaffold tube, little two-footer. We've also got a Duracell battery on that side and a set of keys on the other side. Okay then, so I've uh, just had the battery on charge on the GoPro and probably in the past, what, 40 minutes I'll just show you a few of the little items that I've had. We've had our third knife again, a little kitchen knife again, another little uh, red and little thing. I've had a nice plus skateboard. I uh, don't think it's got anything on it, it's just a pattern on the back of it there. But uh, yeah, really old skateboard. It's all split, it's never going to get used again, it's a shame that. But uh, yeah. I've had this nice, big long square section of uh, probably some hand railing, some kind, that might have once gone up the bridge behind you. So yeah, so that's a nice, nice little find. And I've also had a mop from Wilco's. The thing is, it's still got the thing on the end there, look at that. What's going on there? I've never seen one like that. I love my mopping as well, you know. I absolutely I love spending Sunday afternoons mopping my kitchen. It's so therapeutic anyway, as you can see. And then I've got a massive sign that says something like, walk this way, but it's been split in half. Now, it's made of ugh, something called dye bond. And dye bond has two small pieces of aluminium each side of a solid, like rubber type plastic. Really solid plastic. A lot of the signs are made out of this all the time because they're so light and they're easy to cut and shape. Right then, so uh, the Leeds lads, they're, uh, they're all off now. They've uh, got another mission to go on. So, uh, Say ta-ra to Craigers. Marvellous. I love Craig, I do. It's just, I love him more than any of the others, I'll be honest with you. I do. Uh, Andy. 
And I love like and subscribe, Leeds Magnetiers. Yes, uh, and I also uh, I love Andy. He's my favourite as well. Uh, uh, he's he's always always a favourite. Uh, and then obviously we've got William, the number one of the team. The cap. He's the captain. He's like the top top of the ranker out of the uh, Leeds Magnetiers. So. The old man. And he's my favourite as well out there, Leeds Magnetiers. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, right there, they're going now, and it was such a nice surprise. Tell you what, mate, just go a little bit faster next time. We didn't quite. Yeah, so uh, such a good surprise to see them here today. So uh, let's put that back on there. We'll carry on magnet fishing. Uh, they've not left out for us. They've, they've got a load of stuff out today, absolutely loads of stuff. So, uh, right, I'll we'll switch it back off again. Anything else? With the drag queen, by the way. Did I, did I say earlier on I've got the drag queen out? I can't remember, but anyway, she's up there in the corner, just in case I forgot, because I tell you what, my head's been battered today, there's that many people here, it's like, uh, it's like Piccadilly Circus, it really is, it's mental. Hey, hey, look at that there, birthday boy, how good's that? Hey, marvellous, look at that for a little badge there, like that. I'll have to save that for later on in the year when it's my birthday. And the drag queen's also got out a couple of pennies on that side and one on that side as well. Right, so I've just had a, a nice little spanner here. I'm not sure what uh, what it's for in any way. Uh, don't know if you can see that or not. There. And that's the other end like that. So I'm not sure what type of, uh, what it's actually off. Anybody knows? Leave a comment if you don't mind. Tell us what that is for, uh, yeah. Nice. I'll tell you what I might have to do now though. I think I might have to turn the camera around because the sun's uh, getting in the way a bit. As you can see, and that first badge of the day has come through. And uh, this one is actually called the Iron Maiden. I've not seen one like that before. That's really nice, that. There we go. Superb. I uh, might have to stop throwing my magnet in for a minute because if the drag queen grabs hold of that, I'll be towing it to the side for him. They won't be able to get off, get it, get off me. So uh, the other lads are over there now. They're going to open the lock, hopefully, open the floodgates, and uh, see what happens. Just leave it over there for you. No, I won't. Give me another quick look at that, and I'll have a cup of coffee while I'm waiting for this uh, gentleman to finish uh, manoeuvring his boat or his barge, as we say in the UK. Tell you what, people of Manchester, amazing. Couple just walked past, dropped a box of uh, ice lollies off for us all. One each for lads while we're uh, cleaning the canal. How good's that? I've not had a rocket for ages. Marvellous. Okay, Dan's got to go home now. He's, uh, he's on his way again. We've tidied everywhere up along the path virtually by where I'm fishing now. Uh, I'm going to be here for another two hours at least, yeah. But Dan's going. Uh, goodbye. Marvellous. Another cracking day. It's been picked really well by uh, Ryan and James today, so it's not bad, is it? Right then. So, uh, see you next week then, Dad. Right, see Marvellous. Me. See you later. Stuff is going now as well. Right, magnetic pull. You know the score. We'll be up here or up there or somewhere anyway. So, see you later. Don't forget to give us a sub. I think we will. Definitely give the uh, Sophie a sub there, won't we? Right then, Sophie's going. There's only Ryan and James left now, and they're just tidying up. Uh, Scrapman's already been, which is brilliant. And uh, right, I'm just going to give it a, probably about another half an hour, then I'll be going as well. All right. Okay then, right. Ryan and James, they're both going now as well. So we uh, just want to give you sirs and say whatever. We're knackered. We've got plenty out. I burnt my face. It's been hot. It's been, it's been this sun today. It's been mad. Well, yeah. Check Paul out. Let's get Paul to a thousand subs. One thousand. Very close. You'll be on a thousand before that. Yeah. Give one. Give one. Round of applause for Paul. Oh, there, in a thousand. There you go. <laughs> my head's just gone like that. <laughs> like, uh, like and subscribe if you haven't already. Right. Thank well, you. thanks a lot again. And it was today. It was uh, Ryan and James's idea to come here today. And we've had a cracking day. All the scrap man's gone now, he's, he's took everything. Norman. So, 
Norman, Norman, Norman the Scrap Man, apparently his name, but check out their video because they, again, had an absolutely amazing find again, and I'm just getting a bit, I'm getting a bit sick of it, I really am. I'm not, right then. I'm not coming out with these I'm again. not coming out with these two again, no. Say bye bye. Thank you. Okay then, right, it's time for me to go home now. I'm done. It's uh, gone nearly half past six now. We've had an absolutely cracking day today. Nothing major, no major finds today, to be honest with you. Loads of coins. Uh, like we said, just with Ryan and James, all the scrap man's been. They're talking in the back there. Some people are asking questions about what they're doing and stuff like that. So anyway, as usual, I'll put everybody's stuff all around me who's been out with us today. Uh, and obviously, remember today we had the Leeds Magneteers as well. Uh, William, Craig, Nande. Cracking three lads there. Brilliant. Uh, really enjoyed meeting them again today. So anyway, that's it. Time to go home. Take it easy.